Okay, so we're at Scarborough Camping and Caravan Club site. We're just based near the entrance at the minute, so I'm watching out and there's lots and lots of new people arriving, so it looks like the site's going to be full again this afternoon, once they're all in. Um, had a walk around the site, it's quite empty at the minute. Quite a few went this morning, we came last night and it was extremely full. Um, I'll take you for a little walk around the site later on and see what's happening and show you where a few things are. In the meantime, this is us here. We're parked up down at the bottom end of the site, as I say, near the entrance. Uh, this is our unit, our new awning. Um, we did have a Fiesta awning before this but didn't really get on with it so we bought this one which is the camper rally motor uh, 260 pro much better unfortunately we didn't do a very good job of putting it up the first time but i'm sure we will get better so it's saturday afternoon and Abby's made herself rather comfortable on the bed. I think she thinks she's going to be sleeping in there tonight instead of us. But I think she'll find it's going to be a little bit different to that. So we're having a stroll around the site this afternoon. Taking Abby for a little walk as we go. quite a large site so it'll take us a little while to get all the way around. This is quite full again now after all the new arrivals this afternoon. A nice smell of barbecues as we're walking around this evening. It's a very sunny afternoon, but it's a little on the chilly side. Yeah, it's nice seeing all these people out enjoying themselves again after the last lockdown. So just coming up in front of us is one of the shower and toilet blocks. Um, the camping and caravanning club haven't got their toilets open at the moment. Um, but on the other end of here is the chemical disposal as well and the fresh and waste water points. is enjoying in a wander round. Now we're on the top of the site. You can see right down the hill to the bottom where we are. bench if you fancy a little rest and just at the back you better see them better in a minute there's the ready tents which are the glamping tents that they've got on the camping club sites I'm 
And here we are. One night mine. And we've just spotted some friends of ours, so we'll pick up again in a few minutes. Okay, so we just had a quick chat with some friends of ours that are on this site as well this weekend. Always nice to meet up with friends. Just walking past the ready tents. So we'll just head this way because Abby's left us a nice little present which we need to lose in the bins. Well, this is the back of the recreational block. There's a few activities for kids and that in there, pool table, that sort of thing. Never actually been in because it's never been open yet since we've been coming here due to the COVID. Over here again we've got another toilet block and on the end of it is the chemical disposal which we'll just have a quick look in just so you can see what it's like here there's lots of hand sanitizers out as well for you to use as you walk around and this is the chemical disposal and we'll head off over this way this is a little bit more of a family area at this side. It's got the playground for the children to play on. There's been a few tents here this weekend as well. Same with the little toilet tents at the back of them to make them self-sufficient. Self There's the playground between these two caravans. There's quite a few on it today, so we won't go too close because we don't want to be filming the children. Somebody at the bottom there having a nice barbecue. Since we've done this little walk, it's just what we're going to do as well. It's just so nice to be back out on these campsites, isn't it? Let's hope they don't have to close again. Abby's getting plenty of sniffs in. Because we haven't had any rain, there's plenty of sniffs around for her. Just in case you were wondering, Abby's still quite a puppy. She's just coming up eight months old. She's a cross between a Staffordshire Bull Terrier, a Collie and a Boxer. So she's quite a good mixture of all sorts. But she has a lovely temperament and loves people and other dogs and loves to play. Not quite sure what she's doing but she's found something she really likes there. Down here we have it, another toilet block which as you can see on the sign is closed. I do believe the Caravan and Motorhome Club have opened the toilets but not the showers. So we are heading for a Caravan and Motorhome Club in a couple of weeks. We're going to Burrs Country Park, down to Tewkesbury Abbey from there. Abby's just seen another dog she wants to play with. <laughs> Come on, Abby.
Abby loves seeing all the dogs on the site. She gets really excitable and wants to play with each and every one of them. <laughs> so it's an exceedingly large site, plenty to walk around here if you want to stretch your legs. Not too far from here to go into Scolby Mills which is on the north side of Scarborough. Quite a nice beach area there when the tide goes out and you can go winkling. So now we're heading off back down towards the reception area. I just noticed this nice little hut here. Walked around this site loads of times over the last few days and never even noticed this. So this site definitely has plenty of toilet blocks around for when they do open again, which hopefully won't be too long. We're not too worried, we have no issues with using our own facilities. <laughs> so here we are at the reception area in the entrance this is where you come in when you arrive <coughs> the flags at half mast today it's Prince Philip's funeral was this afternoon so they've lowered the mast down the flag for them for him sorry so as I was saying this is where you come in there's some bays here where you park up when you arrive you don't go into reception at the moment um, they take the money automatically off your card or out of your bank whichever you choose on the day of arrival and then as you come out, they'll come out to you and they'll take you to your allocated pitch. <laughs> Andy's just walked where we're not supposed to walk, but eh her. Huh? We'll go through the gate and do it properly. This is the gate you come and go on if you're coming into this side of the campsite after you've been out. There's a good mixture of vans and motorhomes and caravans on here. Little ones and big ones. And here we are, back at our van. Now it's tea time. So now it's tea time and we've got the caddock out. I've uh, got a bit of chicken cooking on here. Just in there. And we've got a few pork steaks to put on as well. Um, something we bought during lockdown, so this is uh, the first weekend we've actually used it. And we've got quite a good bargain price on it over, over lockdown. There was in the sale that go outdoors, so we thought we'd invest in one. 
And to be honest, it's probably one of the best things we've actually ever bought. Absolutely amazing.